With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, the time period of a spring pendulum when lift moves downward with constant velocity v is t second when the lift moves upward with constant acceleration of g by 3, the time period will be. So, as we know, for a spring pendulum, there are two cases mentioned here. In one case, here it says the lift here is moving downward with constant velocity. So, we can say here, velocity is constant implies acceleration is zero. So we can see here, this is our, let's say here spring pendulum. So for this spring pendulum with mass m attached to the spring, we have the time period given by the formula as t is equal to 2 pi square root of m divided by k. Now this is m is the mass and k is the spring constant. So we can say here for another case, second case here, same mass m attached to same spring or spring constant same k value moving upward with constant acceleration given in the question as g by 3. So we can say here the time period in this question is independent of here acceleration that is it still remains to be 2 pi under root of m by k which here is our time period as t. Hence we can say t dash still remains to be t. Hence amongst the four option, option number four is the correct answer. So four is our answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.